We're investigating a bank robbery that occurred at 840 Britain Road, First Merit Bank, around 1130 this morning. It actually was a bank takeover. Two suspects entered inside the bank, uh, fired shots, and uh, several shots into the ceiling, um, got money, die packs, ran out of the bank itself. Um, uh, witness gave us some information on a possible vehicle that was involved. Several of our officers that were responding to the scene spotted the vehicle, tried to stop it, chased it for a brief time through close to North Akron, um, where two of the suspects bailed out of the vehicle um, and one person stayed in the side of the car. Uh, we have two apprehensions and we also have a third male that appears to be an apparent suicide at this point. Tell us about what happened with the suicide. What, he, he jumped, he ran out of the vehicle when he got here? And yeah, when they were down here in Cascade Village, uh, he took off running from the vehicle, ran towards the railroad tracks, up the hill towards the downtown Akron area. Um, shot was fired and it appears at this time that it is an apparent suicide. In the uh, in the bank, there, there were clearly people in the bank when they fired these shots. Right. Like I said, this was clearly a bank takeover. Shots were fired inside the bank. Um, nobody was injured at this point. We have no injuries reported. Um, so we're still investigating the actual bank robbery itself to identify these suspects that are involved in this. Now, they did not, uh, they, they, they actually left the money as far as uh, you know somewhere? I, I wish I could tell you that. I, I know that somebody has called and said that they found a bank bag with money in it near the bank itself. The die pack exploded. I don't know that. I don't know. I didn't see it on the notes. Okay. Any indication of what the chase was like? Was it high speed? Was it dangerous? Through um, sections or? Actually, it didn't last that long. I mean, it was probably less than a half mile. They did come down here in Cascade Village through the residential neighborhood, through the parking lots, at, where, at which one point they bailed from the vehicle. And, uh, and actually, this was, uh, we were listening to it on the scanners. I mean, this is really some, sh some got to give credit to the officers because they had a vague blue or green description well, and they, they caught up with this right. car pretty Anytime quick. you have a, a robbery of this nature where it's an actual bank takeover, shots are fired, it's very dangerous. For our officers to actually locate the vehicle and then try to chase, you never know what could happen. You know, I mean, they've already fired shots inside the bank and then for our officers to actually come down here and chase, pursue them on foot, chase them through this neighborhood. Like I said, one was apprehended inside the car, one was apprehended a short distance away, and then the third male actually appears at this point to be a suicide. Did the officers ever fire a shot? No, no shots were fired at this point. Of course, I, and I don't want to presume anything, but they've already fired shots inside a bank. If they're running through a neighborhood, that's a concern too. Absolutely. You have small children here. You know, there's people in this community here. As you can see, they're all over the place. And it is very dangerous when you chase somebody like this in this area, knowing that they are armed and trying to get them out of this area. So. Did the guy who shot himself, was there any command from the officer? Or they, or they just came upon him and he was already dead? Or was, that's still under investigation at this point. And the two guys that were caught, they bailed basically the same spot? Well, one was still inside the car. We right. apprehended just, him inside the car. The other one did run from the vehicle and he was apprehended about a block away. And the other one he ran was the guy who right. there. How unusual is it for that situation? You don't have many indications of bank robberies where people actually fire shots. Have have I, don't, I don't want to say it because we've had a, a few yeah. in the last, yeah. Well, the, the thing is, I mean, you, you, this is second bank robbery today in right. the city of Akron. That's yeah, we had an earlier bank robbery at the First Merit Bank in Highland Square on West Market Street. On that actual robbery, they actually passed a note, got money, took off running out of the store eastbound from that location. Uh, no shots were fired, no gun was seen. It's just so many, I mean, it seems like there have been so many bank robberies, right. and, but two in one day, it's, it's, get your hands full. Yeah, it's quite busy.